Hello, Reagan here. Okay, so I finally did it. I finally got some stuff listed on Cat Hair Tea. And I know I said I was going to do this before. Didn't get it done. I kind of put it off. I had all this other stuff going on, but finally it's happened. <laughs> it's happening. So um, what I've listed are the kits that I've built, which I've done videos on. Uh, so there's a Dreamer's Loft, um, the Camper, <laughs> the Detective Agency, uh, Moses' Detective Agency, uh, Jimmy's Workshop, and the Rose Garden Tea Shop, which is right here. Wow, kapow. Anyway, um, these are completed. Uh, if you would like to purchase, instead of purchasing one that I have completed, if you just want to purchase the kit, I will include uh, links to the kits. You know, if that's something that you want to do and you want to build them yourself, but if you don't want to build them yourself and you just want to own something kind of cute <laughs> and kind of cool, um, by all means, you know what to do. And I also have some other stuff that I've made throughout the years. I have uh, some of my Halloween builds like this little guy. <laughs> oh, I don't think you can see him. Yes, there he is. Uh, he's holding a little people in the jar. <laughs> and then I also have my Baba Yaga hut that I made using, um, well, he's made from contractors like styrofoam and some uh, random 3D printed objects, including the little chicken feet, which are 3D printed and some random little greebles and stuff that I had lying around the house. So that will be listed on there as well. And uh, yeah, I'm just trying to clear up my shelves a little bit, declutter a little bit and, um, you know, give, give other people a chance to enjoy some of the stuff that I've put together. And uh, yeah, so be sure to check that out. And then the other thing that I want to talk about really fast while I'm here is where I'm at with my dollhouse. Uh, currently, I'm in the process of getting ready to dye the shingles. I'll record the process when I do this. I just haven't started it yet. I went to Hobby Lobby and I got some dye um, from their, like whatever their company is, the, their dollhouse company, which is actually the same brand as the dollhouse itself. And I got the dye and I got the little bag and I opened the bag to take a look at it before I poured it in the water and it's red. It is not the gray dye that it was labeled as, unfortunately. So um, this was the only one they had. They had one packet. It's not what I want. <laughs> so because it's not what I want, I'm not gonna use it. It's not the color I wanted. So I went on Amazon and I found this, it's K-E-D-A, Keda dye. Um, it's basically the same system as the dye that I purchased at uh, Hobby Lobby, but this one comes with five different colors. It comes with red, yellow, black, brown, and blue. So I'll be able to do a little bit more customization with the color. And um, these are the packets and it, each packet is about the same size as the packet, like as far as the actual volume of what's inside the packet as the packet that I got from Hobby Lobby. So I like the fact that it it's a little bit more flexible. I can mix my own colors, make it a little bit more personal. My plan is to use the black, a little bit of blue, and a little bit of red to give it kind of a purpley undertone. I'll do a little bit of test run and see what I come up with before I actually commit to that. Um, but when I do this process, I definitely will record um, whatever I come up with. I will record the process and you know start to finish so you can see what that looks like. Anyway, um, but yeah, so that's where I'm at right now. Uh, just trying to declutter a little bit and, uh, you know, realize that maybe I might have to actually let go of some of this stuff to make more room for more. <laughs> um, and eventually, like I said it before, I've mentioned it several times, I will, you know, eventually be moving. So I can't hoard it all <laughs> forever. Um, and the more I get rid of, the more I make room for new and uh, makes, gives me an excuse to continue making more kits and building more minis and doing more, more builds uh, if I get rid of some of the ones that I've already made in the past. So, um, and I believe just about everything that I'm listing is something that I've either made a video of or posted on, on social media about. And I'm going to try to incorporate more of that as, going forward as I build things. I'll try to 
be a little bit more thorough with my, my build videos uh, so that those can accompany the listings and the items so that you have that to go along with it. So yeah, anyway, uh, but I'm gonna hop off of here right now. I just figured I would come on, let you know what's going on and uh, you know, pitch my store because I will have the stuff listed in there. Uh, it's up now. So <laughs> thank you. Thank you for your time and be sure to like, share, subscribe, do all that fun stuff. And I will see you in the next video on Wednesday. Bye.